very much for being such a kind, nice audience. I really, really appreciate that. I've got one more I'm going to do for you. I've got records out there. I know I, it feels Golden weird. Warrior. The Golden Warrior was Kevin Von Erich. I wrote a song about him, and it's, it's on the CD that's for sale, but not the vinyl. But it's on the small vinyl, and it's yellow for the Golden Warrior. He's, the, he's such a wonderful human being. Anyways, if you don't know that, I'll tell you about it sometime, or you can watch 30 for 30 about the Von Erich family. It's, there you go. Anyways, thank you so much. If you hate merch tables and you hate websites, just close your eyes tonight. A dream, I'll show up. I'll sing to you the same set, or songs you wanted to hear, but you didn't get to hear. And if you hear something new, sing it to me so I can write it down. I love hearing new stuff by myself. When I moved to Brooklyn from here, I'd never gone to a bar mitzvah before. Then I found out about the bar mitzvah scene. So this lady found me on MySpace and said, can you play my son's bar mitzvah? And then I found out, if you could have a rich father, you could have a bar mitzvah, which is a party. When you're 12 and Jewish, you could have this big old party on the USS Intrepid, and Rod Stewart will play your birthday party. <laughs> this lady didn't have that money, so she went on MySpace and found me. Kid's name was Ernie Goldberg. She said, can you rock up Pop Nagila? I was like, I'll try. I'll try. Then I told my friend Steve. I said, Steve, I'm going to play a bar mitzvah. I've never been to one. It's like, oh man, I had a bar mitzvah. We have themes. My theme was soup. I go, oh, so did you have different kinds of soup at your... No, no, just the different tables had different kinds of soup labels. It was just, it's a theme. We didn't have... You have regular food, but no, it wasn't like a bunch of different kinds. <laughs> You'll see when you get there. It's just, but you guys didn't eat soup? No, I, didn't. I just liked soup, but I didn't want to have soup for the bar mitzvah. I just want to have theme soup. My t-shirt said I had a super time at Steve's bar mitzvah. Super spelled S-O-U-P-E-R. I was like, I have no clue. Then I found out the bar mitzvahs are awesome. So I, I brought my, I couldn't bring my band tonight because they're, they're up in New York still. But I brought a recording of us doing Ernie Goldberg's song, so I'm gonna play a track. Um, and thank you guys so much. My name is Carmo. Thank you, Rhett Miller, for letting me play with you. Um, here's a song I wrote for Sweet Ernie Goldberg's Bar Mitzvah. <laughs> uh, uh.